be using Aran Style Wool. Now it's not Aran Wool, but it, it's kind of, it looks like Aran Wool. Um, and the wool I'm using is quite fine. You'd be better off using a thicker wool. So I'm going to be using two strands of thread. And I'm using a seven millimeter hook. And I'm gonna start by making a slip knot. Like this. And chaining four. One, two, three, and four. And then slip stitch to the top, to the first uh, chain. Pull through and you have made a small circle. And into that circle, I am going to do 12 double crochets. So chain one to start, round one. And into the circle, 12 double crochets. One, two, um, and the last one, 12. And then slip stitch to the top of the first double crochet. We have these threads here. And that's round one. Now for round two, you're going to be doing front post double crochets and you're going to be increasing uh, to double the amount of stitches. So you'll have 24 stitches at the end of round two. So how I start this is I chain one and around the very first post, so instead of going into the top of the stitch, go around the post and do a front post double crochet and do another one in the same stitch. And in the next one, do two front post double crochets in the same stitch and continue this until you've 24 double crochets in the round. And I've come to number 24 um, and what you do then is you slip stitch to the top of the first stitch in that round. Now if you turn over you'll have like a lip and that's the only time you'll get that in this hat. So for round three you are just doing ordinary double crochet. So if you chain one and you're going to increase in every second stitch. So you're going to do two double crochet into the first stitch and one double crochet into the next stitch. Two double crochet into the next stitch and one double crochet into the next stitch and so on right around until you get back to the beginning of the round. <clears throat> When you get to the end of this round, you just uh, slip stitch to the top of the first stitch in the round. Now for the next round, which would be round four, chain one, and you've finished increasing at this stage. So now I'm just going to do one single crochet in each stitch uh, in the round, and you should have 36 stitches all together. And again, just slip stitch to the first stitch, and now we're ready to start doing our iron pattern. So if you take this hat here, the iron pattern is gonna consist of two outside rows, a plait in the middle, and four ordinary double crochets in the middle of the, the, the rows. Um, so how you start is chain one, and we're gonna start doing triple crochets. So. Do a triple crochet around the post. Front post, triple crochet around the first stitch. Like that. Then skip a stitch and into the next stitch do a, a front post triple crochet. Like that. And do a triple crochet in the next stitch. Okay. And next what you do is go back into the stitch that you missed. So do a triple crochet and go back into the stitch that you missed and you will see that that stitch crosses over these two stitches. And then I'm going to do a triple crochet into the next stitch, front post. And now I'm going to do four ordinary double crochets in the next four stitches. One, two, three, and four 
and I'm going to repeat the pattern again from like over here. So do a triple crochet around the post of the next stitch. Skip a stitch and do one triple crochet around the post of the next two stitches. And go back into the stitch that you missed. So triple crochet into that stitch and one more triple crochet in the next stitch along. And you're back to doing four ordinary double crochets. One, two, three, and four. Um, and now repeat this pattern two more times. So you're going to do this, uh, four double crochets, this again, and four more double crochets, and it will bring you back to the beginning of the round. Right, I've come to the end of the second row of the plaited pattern. Just slip stitch to the top of that. Now, you're going to continue this pattern for probably another five rows, five plaits. Um, so you're doing the front post triple crochet, the little plaited section, front post triple crochet and four double crochets in between. And you continue round and round until you have the desired length of the hat. I generally do seven of these all together, seven rows. Um, and when you get to the end of that, I will meet you back and show you how to make the rim. I've now done seven rows all together of the uh, plaid, plaited pattern, and I'm just going to slip stitch to the top of the first row. So it's really easy to see now the pattern, how it turns out, and it turns out really well, and it's really simple to do. So all that's left to do now is the brim of the hat. And what I do is I chain one, and I'm going to be doing front and back post single crochets in this round. So front post single crochet, next stitch, back row, single crochet front row, front post should I say, single crochet, back post, single crochet and just continue that right round. So I finished doing the brim and just slip stitch to the top uh, and weave your wool in and out of your hat and that's your hat finished.